Hop off the bike and lock it, the light reflecting off it, looking so kaleidoscopic. Group of people talking, obviously on the topic. They ask if I'm a doctor, I told them no I'm not yet. But if I was a doctor, I'd be like Dr. Soups, mixing up the alphabet. Ooh, now that's a proper soup. I kind of end up looking at um, rapping as like putting together like a like a puzzle. I'm gonna be a prodigy, just like my parents thought I'd be. Said I'm squandering my doctorate, partying hard and lost in the gossip. English language gives you certain pieces, you know, certain words or like word categories um, have stress that falls in certain places or like you can put phrases together in only these certain ways. So like these are the pieces that English gives you and then how to put them together to f create like a picture. I'll leave a Frank a bottle away. Oh, let's see. I need a little street. I barely rank of a pill, but only superficially. My studies um, center largely around hip hop, so like my thesis is about freestyle rap. I collected a bunch of samples of people freestyle rapping here in Athens and I'm transcribing and analyzing them. I'm looking at it as like a form of literacy, like a set of language skills that people master but that aren't generally valued within like mainstream contexts like school. So that really like informs the way I um, go about writing and freestyling because you know I sit down and I'm studying people's um, skills all the time. I started Hot Corner Hip Hop because in my first year of living in Athens, I really didn't find any community like this that was established where people um, in the hip hop scene were being celebrated in this way. So like we all kind of have a place to gather and we like know each other a lot better and interact a lot more frequently. That community has gotten more acclaim than it was in the months and perhaps years before this like um, regular event started happening. It has seen a resurgence lately, so that's really exciting. Something that perhaps isn't obvious in the songs themselves, but definitely motivated the songwriting was like obsession. So worrying constantly about things like um, like my performance in school or um, mental health issues or um, drugs and stuff like that. You know, it sort of gave me the catalyst to get these songs done. But late labor wages, to place it like Jamaica, ranges from this time to changes to blatantly dangerous. No money in savings, no savings to take a vacation. No vacations, though we have world famous drinking changes. Another recurring theme you'll find is just vulnerability and just like being honest about things being hard. I think that's probably the big thing that will be readily apparent. You see that girl on that gold bike, that gold bike, that that girl rides, that girl right, such cold rhymes, that girl might go worldwide. Ooh. That was, that was <laughs> sick. Oh my God. Thanks. That was awesome.